Ladies and gentlemen, the anti-life equation has happened. It destroyed the nuclear reactor. We're going nuts. I got a beard. Ray's my best friend. Welcome back to Saturday Morning Cartoons. Ah. This is Saturday Morning Cartoons. I'm Doug McDevils and next to me, like I said, is the greatest best friend of all time, Rain Flair II. And we are on episode nine of Kite Man, ladies and gentlemen. One more episode after this, and it is the end of it. We're almost at the end. Dude, it's we're almost, crazy. It's wild to what see where we started to now. I know. I, I know it. We I'm did just, a we did a whole season of a show, a whole reaction. This is a monumental thing. We're nine out of ten episodes. We've never done this. I'm so proud of us. I'm so proud of us. We are on episode nine. The anti life equation has destroyed the nuclear reactor. They are still on the run from Villigans and Lex Luthor. Bane has Goldilocks. Queen of Fables has her body back. And Frank turned on him. What's gonna happen in episode nine? Let's find out. Babe, we probably don't have time for this discussion. I think the nuke explosion tipped our location. Damn it! God damn, he loves cutting a word off halfway. Briefcase is way in the back. We stay on the move and fulfill every kid's dream of being on the open road, hauling chicken. <laughs> Guy been so unpredictable. <laughs> Bro, what? What did they just create? What did they just create? What? Dark side, it's dark side. Dark side, it's dark side. I love a dark side that's annoyed by his choir. That's kind of fucking funny. Serving drinks to the scum of an already derelict species. I take it easy with the compliment. Six pack is the worst. I have excellent news. It's time for you to serve me. One litre vino coming up. No. One litre vino. Litre vinos for all of my friends. Help me enslave the entire universe. Like today? Poor Malice. She's kind of grown on me in nine episodes. Well, I suppose. After all, I don't take orders from anyone. I want a lollipop. Coming right up. Uncle Bane is the best. When I was your age, I did not have shoes. I was in a pit. I would use my imagination and invent stories for the rocks. They and the darkness were my only friends. I love it, man. Bane needs his own goddamn show. Oh, I'm the Casio, babe. I tipped generously at the hotel. The hotel that ratted us out to Villigans? Those people live off tips. Those people live off tips. Oh, that man's such a good guy. Well, okay. Yeah, sure. I, I totally want to. The choir is just shooting pool. That's incredible. This is a great dark side. I have sought this information for a thousand generations. Now, to fulfill my destiny... Keep the Lichorinos cold for my return. Show the classes it really helps! God, I love Dark Side, dude. He seems reasonable. He came to celebrate killing my parents. Shit on a prick, I've got on a stick! I don't know what the saying is! I am screwed! Yeah, she's kind of screwed, Yeah, man. a little bit. She's kind of screwed. Now let's get a look at these chicken thieves. <laughs> Bro. What the hell's in there? Chuck, I told you! You were right, and obviously that's what we should be focused on at this moment. <laughs> Fucking kite, man. Oh, clock in hell! See? Clever line feels pretty good sometimes. Facts. Oh, Welcome shit. to Saturday Morning Cartoons. You had it hidden for months in a dive bar under chicken nuggets. What were you waiting for? The obvious thing? His birthday? Or am I some kind of rube who killed Superman on a random Tuesday? True. He's got aura to think about. Silence! I despise pleasantry. He hates small talk! The choir just makes me giggle every time. Time to step aside and let the big dog eat. Woof, woof! Bro, the choir's the fucking best. I'm sorry, they're, they're, they're so funny. Hey, what happens to Princess Rebecca? Yeah, I'm riveted. Ah, uh, yes. Well, next our brave hero, Baines. He's really having his Forrest Gump moment, isn't he? Kai 
Man, agile as hell. I didn't eat the eggs. I swear. They, they gave me the wrong order. Christ. There it is. God damn it, Kite Man. You will bring the anti life equation to me now, or your friend will die. That piece of shit. Oh my god. I'm gonna teach these guys a lesson I learned in WW1. How the fuck old is this guy? Let's go, dude! What the fuck? <laughs> oh shit, we're getting another bar fight. Let's go. Let's go, Noonan. What? What a absolute goat. That man's gonna drown. What's the best way to kill a bird? Oh, dude. They want the fucking cat. That is still unwritten. So there's still time for her to get a happy ending? What? You are not old enough to know. Oh. Bane. You're not old oh enough to know. Good lord, bro. Going back in. Ew, what is this? Rumpus. <laughs> Ruh-ro. Bane's about to pop off, bro. I must protect my friends. Uh. Let's go, Bane. Don't go anywhere until I get back, okay? Okay, but I have to go party. Hey, do whatever you need to do, just go. I will. But it's not number one. Damn, the portal potty. Oh, no. <laughs> Noonan's an animal, by the way. Oh, I thought Bane was going to catch it and throw it back or something. There's a chicken in there. Make Cheshire eat it. She's vegan now. Malice. Fine. Cheshire. Yummy body. <gasps> Cheshire, no. <laughs> no, Cheshire. Cheshire. <laughs> What just happened? Honey, I really think we should wait for interest rates to go down. <laughs> I can't, bro. This chicken. All right. You've convinced me I'm going vegan. <laughs> Spared. Spared for now. What in the world? <laughs> this chicken is wild. Older than you. Okay, Noonan. Where's your money? Ah, force a habit. <laughs> Fuck yeah, Mo. Hey, where's my fucking money? We are not coming out to fight until you agree to our demands. I mean, you can't disappear for months, then show up and think we'll do your bit. <gasps> Jesus Christ. Ah, damn. <laughs> Now it's nobody in Gretel. Anybody else want to start a union? <laughs> Jeff Bezos is about to take notes about her union busting. Uh, God damn. Uh, <laughs> babe, we gotta get this chicken away from its all-you-can-eat buffet. On it. One beer. He's just snacking, bro. Fair enough. Nailed Fucking it. kite man, dude. Even when he wins, he loses. God damn oh, yeah. right. Cheshire got that get back, bro. Think that briefcase tastes like chicken? God, I love you, babe. Oh, I love it so much, dude. Let's go. Fighter's the best. You to make sure you didn't poop yourself to the 1980s. Mm. I am a terrible babysitter. Damn it, babe. No. Damn it. Yes. That pushy clerk. What was his name? Brandon! Right. Brandon. I'm telling you, these pet stores are dens of thieves. <laughs> they are! Robbed! Track my demon pet app. Where Cheshire is, there you will find malice. Excellent. 
It's time to get the truth from my goddaughter. The track my demon app. Oh my goodness, dude. Top class. Pet stores nowadays are highway robbery. I'm glad Darkseid agrees. Yeah. Oh my goodness, dude. What an excellent fucking episode. Dude, the season finale is going to be so yes. great! Back in episode two, when, when Kite Man and Darkseid became friends, we said, is this going to be Kite Man versus Darkseid? And then they became friends. But really, it's just about to be Kite Man versus it's Darkseid. It's going to be a thousand percent. Well, hold on. No, it's going to be Man versus Darkseid because he has no fucking kite. Oh, yeah. He's still naked. He's still Chuck. He's naked. It's Chuck versus Darkseid. Yeah. Ladies and gentlemen, if you don't know now, you know, tune in because season, er, season one, episode 10 finale is coming soon. We'll see you guys next time. Hey, what happened? Why are those squiggles on the screen? Those are called end credits, Patrick. End credits? But I don't want it to end.